Hello, Paul is the best for UK here and welcome to today's Game of Day video. Now today's game is called Cosmic Carnage for the Sega 32X. So let's have a look at this one. On first boot up of the game you get to see this like synopsis. We'll just skip past this for Game of Day. So we've got Cosmic Carnage here, uh, 1994 Sega Enterprises. So this is another game I've never heard of before. So Sega must have made quite a few games I've never heard of. So we've got difficulty, we can have easy up to hard, I presume easy is 1 and hard is 5. So I'm going to go for 1 because I'm crap at games. Ok so let's come out of that bit and let's go on to one player and let's start the game. Hmm. So the computer is randomly selecting the character. So we've got this character selection screen, we've got all these weird and wonderful looking characters. I'm going to be this quite crazy looking snake guy. So, yep, we are Na Naja vs Cyclic. Battle 1 fight. Okay, so as you can see, this is a fighting game. A one on one fighting game in the style of Street Fighter 2. And potentially Street Fighter 1, actually. But yep, I've got this weird snake. Oh, you fuck. So it has got some zoom effects, so that sort of like shows it's the, uh, the uh, Mega. Sorry, the uh, Sega 32X capabilities. Got some nice music in the background. I got I got like a massive tail whip, which is quite funny. Have some of that with my tail. I've got no legs, have I? I've just got tail. Have some of this. Have some of this cyclic, and have some of that. See, the game plays quite well on the uh, the 32x here. First impressions are okay. Not too bad of a game. There we go. Got him. Have some of that. So Naja wins, and Taju remain in life as well on that one. That's the best of three I think, so the second round here. Let's try and get him. Okay, so at the top you've got um, how much energy you've got for both players. You've also got the time limit, so the game's time limited as well. Have some of that. You can do a pose at him as well, watch. Watch this, this is funny. Pose! <laughs> That's quite funny, that makes me laugh. Okay, so yeah, let's get him. Have some of that. You can also do like this biting move on him. Have some of these. And have some of that. Oh, you fuck! Are these bits of blood and glory go in the game? I couldn't tell you off by hand if this was an 18 or not. A little bit of blood in it. I was quite sensitive to uh, blood and gore in the uh, early 90s on video games. Okay, so yeah, let's try and get, get him. Have some of that. He only needs a couple more hits. There we go, got him. So we get to see the next level. I'll do it like a victory dancer. So on to the next level here. Oh, so you can change the level. No, you can't. It's that, you can't change the character. It's just shows the same one again for me. Now as you can see, we're on like a spooky mountain ground, quite atmospheric actually with the music and everything. Have some of that. The Mega Drive could have probably handled most of this game without the 32x power I'm guessing, except for maybe the zoom in and zoom out um, effects. It's just a simple, it's, it's not polygon, maybe the uh, ground is sort of polygon related but the, the game just uses normal traditional sprites. They're quite big in size though and they've got quite fluid animation so maybe it does need a bit more power than the Genesis Mega Drive can handle alone. And saying that, have you saw Dynamite Heady on the Mega Drive? That's a masterpiece that is. Anyway, so yep, let's try and get your gear. What, it's just a pause button if you do that. Well, what I'm going to do is I'm going to reset the emulator because you, you know, I, wanna cho I just want to choose a different uh, player. So we can have a look at one of the other guys. So we've done a soft reset of the emulator here. There's the Sega logo. And let's start again. So let's go past this bit. You can have two players on the game of course. I'm going to try a more maybe normal looking guy like this guy here. Oh on this one you can choose different things as well. You can have that one. I oh, can choose red or blue on that bit. Ah, okay. So let's start the game. So it's Xenoland versus Naruto. I 
Okay, so I want some sort of lift here. So I'm the one on the left this time. Whoa, got a massive sword. Oh, you fuck. He just got me with his electric bolt. What am I doing jumping up there? Have some of that. So yeah, the game does qu seem quite fun to play and um, quite quite a nice little uh, fighting game. It's by no means the best fighting game, but it's by no means the worst either. Actually, it's him who's got the sword, not me. I'm the one in the red armor. I'm the one with the electric bolt. Have some of that. Look at his hair. It's like a fire hair. Right, okay. Let's try and get him with the electric bolt. Oh, you fuck, I missed him. Oh, he got me with that massive sword again. Have some of that. It does do like a slow motion when you do it in the sort of Matrix style. I do a little pose with my fire hair. So yeah, that was a quick look at uh, Cosmic Carnage on the Mega Drive 32X. I'm going to give this one 7 out of 10. So uh, thank you for watching. Goodbye!